Hello Piscean, welcome back to my channel. This is your next 48. This is episode 30 and 31 of March. This is for Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. If you have questions about getting a personalized reading, you know what to do. Check that description box. Everything you need is there. What you see is what you get. This is for Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. Okay, so let's see what this is for you. Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. Okay. Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. Okay. Okay, we have the Two of Wands falling out. So trying to decide what you want to do. You have two paths to choose. Do you want to stay where you are or go somewhere else? Okay, we have the uh, Queen of Pentacles. It could be an Earth sign. And we, okay, we do have the Ten of Cups. What's the other side of the Two of Wands, please? I'm curious. We have the Judgment. So you're trying to decide if you want to give this person a second chance. Uh, this could be somebody deciding this for you. It looks like somebody does make you happy. They, they do fulfill your needs in some way, emotionally, all right? We do have the Moon card under there. So this could be something that's in your subconscious and uh, uh, maybe a dream or a, a, a something that you're imagining. Okay, what's the Ten of Cups energy? So it looks like something is resurfacing, a thought about this person, maybe a decision that you made regarding this person. What's the, what is the Ten of Cups? Okay, we have the Page of Wands. So you're, you're getting good news from this person. They're sending you a message. This could be your mother. Okay, or a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. What is the Queen of Pentacles? Okay, we have the Four of Cups. Looks like somebody wants to take you out. Somebody wants to go out on a date. Somebody wants to date again. It looks like a repetitive conversation, though, with the Four of Cups. Something... It's happening over and over again. It looks like a vicious cycle. It looks like it's happening again here with the judgments card. Something keeps resurfacing. All right. I'm getting to you keep going on somebody's page over and over again, like looking looking through the same post over and over again. All right. What's the two of wands? It's almost like it makes you happy just to look at this person's photos or look at their posts, even if they're not new. It could be an old photo or it could, this could be old photos in your phone that you're just kind of looking at. Okay, what's the two of wands? Okay, we have the three of wands. Yeah, so it looks like, it looks like a long distance relationship or someone that's distanced from you. You feel disconnected from this person. We do have the devil card. Yeah, something, something is obsessive. You have an obsession with something or with someone. It could be an obsession with something online or somebody online. But I'm getting it's a long distance relationship or this could be like a, um, a dating app. Looks like somebody is very clingy though. If you are dealing with this person in the physical, somebody is very clingy. You're trying to decide if, if you can look forward to this, if, if, if this is worth it. Is there potential here? Is there a future with this person? Do you see them in your future? Like, what do you want? Where is this going with the Three of Wands? Okay, what's the Three of Wands energy? It's kind of like you're, it's kind of like you're trying to see the fortune, the fortune before it's time to see it. You could be uh, looking at, um, you know, of course, readings, fortune tellers, but it's like you, you kind of want to know what's going on. It's like you don't want surprises. Okay, what's, what's the Three of Wands, please? Yeah, the, okay, that's what I was getting, the high priestess. It's, it's like you want to know what's going on, but it's not, it's not time for you to know. I'm also getting too, this person wants to know everything about you. It could be a fire sign. Somebody is very nurturing, very attentive. But I'm getting it could be a little bit of annoying or somebody could be a little bit of a bore or overbearing. Because somebody wants to know everything about you. They're overbearing. You know, they're always, they just, they're always inside your head. They want to know everything. Okay. It, I mean, it could be, it could be because this person is, is at a distance from you. 
and that's all they have. They can't touch you. They can't be with you. But I'm getting somebody is very overbearing. They're always on your social media. They're always going through your phone. Okay, they're just, I'm, I'm getting somebody, maybe, I'm getting you make somebody very happy, but they could be very overbearing. Okay, this could be a mother or somebody who acts like your mother. Someone who's very nosy with the high priestess. What is the four of cups? The four of cups, please. Now this could be your mother. She keeps calling to check in and maybe you're away at school or you are away, but this person keeps calling to check up on you, texting you. They won't leave you alone. They won't let you work. This person just wants to know what you're doing. I'm getting there's no reason for it. They just want to be nosy. What's the four of cups energy? Yeah, we have the world card. Yeah, you're, you're over this. You're over it. I'm getting this could be somebody who's across seas. This could be a letter that you're opening. All right. It looks like something is over. Something's going to end. Okay, we have the Hierophant. Yeah, it looks like you're deciding to end this. Somebody, somebody is just a little bit too smothering for you, too overbearing, okay, too motherly, maybe too attentive, too affectionate, too something. I'm getting too, somebody could be too intuitive. Maybe this person is hard to read or it's hard to hide things from this person. Okay, what's the page of wands? What is the page of wands energy? Yeah, we have the six of cups. It looks like this could be an ex or somebody that you somebody that you are familiar with, somebody from your past. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting somebody's like watching your page or you're watching this person, or at least you used to. Okay, with the six of cups energy, this, this could all be behind you already happened before. The ten of cups is we have the nine of pentacles. Yeah, you're looking at somebody's selfies, somebody's images, pictures. This could be your own selfies, of course. You're looking at old photos, period, of this person. Maybe old photos from your travels. When you were traveling, you could be posting old pictures here of, of when you were traveling. This could be you or someone else online. I'm getting a, I'm getting I'm getting a lot of traveling photos. Maybe you're you're looking at, you know, other people's uh, photos of them traveling. Somebody's on vacation here. All right. But I'm getting, I'm getting it's on your mind. Maybe somebody is like posting too much or too often and that's annoying you. You're like, oh my God, stop posting your life. Who cares about you? All right, let's see. <laughs> what is the high priestess? What is the high priestess, please? Yeah, the ten of swords. It's like somebody wants you to stop posting online or stop, stop posting pictures. Or like somebody wants you to ignore someone. There's someone here who wants you to cut something off. I'm getting communication. Maybe what you post or how you post. Stop posting old photos, maybe of them. There's something going on here. It's like somebody wants to end something. Somebody wants to stop communicating. Like this is two cards uh, indicating an end. Definitely something is over. But it looks like somebody is still posting old photos of you or old photos of you and them together. Maybe you guys are on vacation. They're still kind of posting old pictures even though you guys are not together anymore. This could be disturbing you, maybe annoying you a little bit. Like, why are they posting those? Why, are, why do you even still have those pictures of me or of us? All right. Yeah, we have the eight of cups. You're just, you're over it. You're like walking away. You don't care. You're over it. Whatever. It's whatever. Okay. Somebody could be posting photos of your children too. What's the six of cups? But I'm getting this is an X though. All right. What's the six of cups energy? What is the Six of Cups, please? Yeah, the Knight of uh, Knight of Swords. It looks like, okay, so it looks like somebody did have old photos of you on their page and they're going to delete them. So that could be, the, that could be this as well. Somebody is finally deleting all those photos of you on their page or in their phone. I'm getting you or somebody else is deleting pictures. Maybe of an ex or an ex is deleting your photos off their page or off their phone. What's the night of swords? Or somebody could be asking you to do this. Why do you still have photos of your ex in your phone? Get rid of those, of those pictures. Okay, what's the night of swords? What is the night of swords, please? Yeah, we have the night of the nine of cups. So somebody wants you to get rid of these pictures. Or I'm getting somebody wants you all of a sudden. This is a very scattered reading. I'm sorry about that, Piscean. Yeah, but it's like something something happen, happens and it makes you happy. All right? Somebody is, giving you, somebody is giving you your way or somebody is communicating with you here. 
Maybe something that you thought was dead. Somebody's resurfacing. All right. I'm getting somebody has been watching you here with the nine of pentacles. Somebody admires you even. We do have the five of pentacles. Somebody feels forgotten about, about you. Somebody feels like you forgot about them. And this person could be approaching you or they could start following you or they could be commenting on your page. Something that's very nice, very sweet. Okay. Maybe even like, you know, saying how beautiful you are, your pictures. So I'm going to leave it there. Don't forget to like the video, leave your comments and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.